Hi, how are you? Thank you for joining me today. Uh, yeah, so I am going to be uh, opening up some packs. A couple, just a few. Um, because, you know, Pokemon. Uh, yeah, so basically what I did is I, uh, I went to coffee. I went to a couple stores, Target, Walmart, and saw some deals, saw some promos, promotionalizers, and decided I was going to pick up some, some Pokemon cards. And to give you a backstory, um, I played Pokemon a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away when I was a younger kid. And, uh... You know, kind of lost all the cards. Probably had some first edition Charizards, but I imagine they're probably pretty beat up. So, you know, not really going to worry about those because they're all gone. So I thought, well, you know, I'll get back into it. And, you know, walking around grocery stores, seeing some, some dealios. I saw some uh, stuff that was on sale and uh, decided I was going to pick up some things. So I'll um, be launching this channel this week. We're going to be opening Pokemon cards. It's pretty, uh, I guess, straightforward. But, uh, what I got in terms of cards is uh, what you're about to see. So to start with, I uh, I got a Unified Minds. I think this is called a blister pack. I don't know, but this is a Unified Minds pack. Hello. So we're gonna open that. Comes with a cool little thingy there. That's pretty neat. I like that. Uh, also got a Lost Thunder pack. Hello. Right there. So we're gonna open that too. And I thought, well, you know, that that's pretty cool, but that's probably not enough. So I was at Walmart and I found a clearance pack of a Shining Legends box. And it's a two pack. So this one has this guy and this guy. And it was on clearance. So we got that for like half the normal price. Oh, and it also has these awesome pins in it too. I don't know if you can see those, but you got that guy there. And you got this guy here. So it's a pin collection with three packs each and the hollow card of each one. So pretty nifty there. Um, and then I saw they were releasing these other things, uh, the Hidden Fates packs. So I bought these. I've got a Charizard one here, which is pretty neat. It's got a big old Charizard in the back, a little Charizard. Don't talk to me or my son ever again pack going on here. And I got four packs of those. So I got those. <clears throat> oh, and I also got a Gyarados one. So I got that. And then I also got a, a Raichu one, so I got that. And then I saw this thing, this uh, big box, Legacy Evolution Pin Collection, hello. Look like Wilson from Home Improvement. Mm -hmm. So this one has Slowking, Blissey, Crobat, Blossom, Politoed, and Steelix EX. All hollows, it looks like, and it also looks like there's one, two, three, four, five packs in here that are uh, Steam, Siege, Evolutions, uh, Sun and Moon, an original pack of Sun and Moon, and other Evolutions, and whatever this is. I don't know what this is. This could be something cool. Probably not, though. And then it's also got a Crobat pin, which is pretty sweet. So we got that going on. Let me move these real quick so I can get to the other things. And then I thought, well, heck, I'm opening up all these sweet little packs. Why don't I go ahead and get some other things? So I got a Sun and Moon Burning Shadows Elite Trainer Box, which is good because I guess this comes with uh, sleeves. So I need some sleeves to protect some of my cards in case I get some fancy cards in my new collection. Uh, another Sun and Moon Elite Shadows Box, or Burning Shadows. Sorry, guys, it's my first time. Um, the sweet yellow one, Sun and Moon Guardians Rising. And also a uh, Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion box. Cause I thought this guy was pretty cool. I, I caught him in uh, Sword and Shield. And uh, looking forward to opening this one too. Maybe I'll get some cool stuff in there. So uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna be opening this week. Uh, obviously across a series of respective videos. But uh, yeah, stay tuned. We're gonna open one of those boxes today. So we'll see you in a minute. All right, so I think I'm gonna open up a Burning Shadows Sun and Moon Elite Trainer Box first because I need the thingies out of it, the uh, card sleeves. So this comes with eight booster packs, 65 sleeves, sleeves, 65 sleeves, 65 sleeves featuring Necrozma, which is, I guess, this fella. Seems like a nice guy, real chipper lad. 
Uh, 45 Pokemon Energy Cards, which I really don't need. Player's Guide, six damage counter dice, one competition legal coin flip die, two acrylic condition markers, and one acrylic GX marker. Ooh. Collector's box, don't want everything with four dividers, keep it organized, and a code card. Wow, fancy. Ooh. So here's the player's guide. Actually, here's the player's guide. Pretty, uh, pretty nifty there. Got a lot of uh, pictures, I guess. So if you're trying to do some collections, maybe. Got some nice handy pictures in it. Didn't know that was in there. Pretty neat, neat nifty. A uh, piece of cardboard, throw that in the garbage. And the box itself, this is pretty nice. So we're gonna flip it over here to this camera. Get the unboxing action going on. And ooh, hello. I like it already, so I assume these are probably worthless energy cards. So we'll just throw those over there. Look at these. Oh, and I don't, I don't play this. So anybody that wants that, there it is. You can have it, not mine. Set these here. Where's the rest of them? There they are. Set these here. Ooh, look at the necrozma sleeves. Those are pretty fancy. I like those. And then we have the Burning Shadows, I guess more Necrozma things. What are these? Is this like a thing so I can divide my, my collection in, in this box? I don't know. Or cardboard garbage or cardboard garbage. Look at these cool little dice. They got little symbols on them. They're pretty fancy. And then look at this. This is neat too. I got a Band-Aid and a skull and the GX marker in there, which appears to be magnetic or something. I don't know, interesting, but whatever. We'll throw those back in the box. Throw this back in the box. And these are pretty neat, but I think we're gonna throw those back in the box too. Oh, they do kind of kind of blend them out a little bit. So I guess you can split your, your collection up a little bit. Neat and nifty. We'll let the cat destroy those down there. So I wanna open up these first real quick because in case we get anything fancy, I wanna have them at my disposal. I'm prepared. So I'm gonna set those over here. Make sure we're ready to rock and roll. Nice and dusty this crap is. So here we go. Without further ado, let's get it started in here. Let's put this guy over here. Put him back there. It looks pretty neat. Oh, it makes my lucky charm look menacing. This is my lucky charm, by the way. I'm not sure why he's my lucky charm, but he's my lucky charm. So let's go. First pack, Sun and Moon Burning Shadows. Oh, I've been looking forward to this for a while. Oh boy, I forgot I gotta spin it this way so nobody can see it. So there's that, in case anybody wants that, throw that in the garbage. I hope it's four, but I'm not sure. Yeah, it's four, and I cheated already, so. Uh, let's see, we got a Leaf Energy, a Buffalant, Olivia, uh, Kaiway, I apologize Kaiway if I mispronounced your name, Meowth, a nice little deal. Look at that little guy. He's having such a good time. An Aeolian Grimer. Mm. Ladybug. Cutie Fly. A little reverse hollow Charmander. And, ooh, a little fire energy to go with our little Charmander. Look at that. It's so shiny. It's so fancy. Cool. So that was kind of a waste of a first pack. But I mean, you know, this this is probably, is this like, is this gold? Is this, this is a, this is a secret rare right it's a secret rare fire so this might actually be worth something so i'll go ahead and just stick it in here you know just in case it's any good or not i don't know what it's good or not but you know and this little charmander i don't know i, I like charmander so i'm gonna put him in here too just because i like the little fella so we'll stick those over there what's going to be really funny about this is that i don't know what the value is on some of these things so this pack also feels very heavy by the way this one feels quite chunky so, you know, it could be worth something quite a lot and I'll have no idea until I actually go and look it up later. So there's that for those people who like that kind of thing, feed it to the cat. There's that, feed it to the cat. So we have a fairy energy, another Olivia, Lunatone, uh, Plumeria. She's got a hair thing going, look at that. Hello, do you like my hair? Looks like she got burned on her belly too. Interesting, maybe it's a tattoo. Another Charmander, non-fancy. Pan Seer. That's what you do to steaks, right? You pan sear them. Pikachu. Oh, look at how cool he is. He's so angry. Got you, Pikachu. 
Krogunk or Kragunk or Kragunk, Magikarp, Magikarp, and I got a kitty cat trying to climb up here. Get down, say hello. Hello. Now get down. We have a Persian reverse. It's pretty nice looking, and a Araquanid, which is, I guess, the rare, but you know, not that cool. Okay, sweet, neat. <laughs> So far, relatively uneventful in these packs. Slip that guy in there. And you know what I'm really happy about is I'm happy how easy they open. Because usually when I try to open these packs, it's like ridiculous how hard they are to open. There's that. Throw it on the ground. One, two, three, four. Did I get four or five? I don't know. That's funny too, because that one felt heavier and it wasn't any better. So we got some hot potato energy. We got a Simiseer, another Another fire energy and a fire Pokemon coming after him. A heat more. Oh, heat more. It's cold in here. Heat more. It's cold. Lana. Sock. Toga Demaru. I probably mispronounced that, but that's okay. Wimpod. Aeolan Rattata. Rattata. Another Magikarp. A reverse hollow Meowth. So I have the. Reverse Hollow Persian, and now the Reverse Hollow Meowth, and a Darkrai GX. This looks pretty good, right? I mean, it seems like it's pretty neat. I don't know, but he's gonna go in here. He's a little bent, but he looks like he's kind of in the middle. Is that good? I don't know. I don't know what's good or not. That looks like it's kind of in the middle. I don't know. There's a little spudge up there, but hopefully that's good. I don't know. We'll find out in the future. Slip him in there. Don't mess it up. Put him there. We'll put our Meowth in here too. Hello, little Meowth. I like the design on there, it's pretty cool. Review for good luck. Next pack. A lady bar. I'm cheating now. I'm already I'm already seeing what the lady bar is. There's that. Throw it on the ground. One, two, three, four. Here we go. We have dark energy, I guess. A super scoop up. Use that in the uh, litter box, the super scoop up. Surviper. Rotom Dex, Ladyba, Inke, Crabrawler. It looks like one of those uh, those things you put on dogs so that they don't scrape their claws on things. He's got the little booties on, Crabrawler. Tynamo, it looks like someone crocheted that. That's nifty. A Tangela, a Noctowl, Reverse, and a Meow Stick. Oh, adorable, albeit, but not hollow so not having the best of luck so far with our fancies now that dark ride could be worth like eight thousand dollars i don't know but probably not so we have four packs left so we're halfway through and so far we've had one gx nothing too fancy or exciting going on so we'll hopefully get something better oh i missed the card there it is so here's that for you guys Throw it on the ground, one, two, three, four. And we have lightning. Will we have a lightning Pokemon coming up after it? No. Ribombe. It sounds like the thing that they say in Black Panther to, uh, like the battle cry, Ribombe, but it's not. Uh, Corellia, Olivia, Rhyhorn, we already saw you. Tangela, Dupiter, or Dupiter. Noibat, Noibat. Another Pikachu, a Reverse Scolipede, and a Crabominable. So another non-hollow rare. We are not having good luck in this box. I don't know. I'm not feeling very elite trainer from this box, if I'm honest. But I guess that's what you get. It's the luck of the draw, right? We're not here to pull fancy cards every time we're here to pull all the cards every time there's that one two three four and we have some punching energy fighting energy a porygon two or do or dos a metapod lana banana more laws we need more laws do skulls oddish Another Tynamo. I like that little design on there. That's kind of cool. Looks like my grandmother made it. She might have, I don't know. Mudbray, the Kiki Boy. Potown, reverse, and an Electros, non 
follow. We are getting shafted on these rare. I'll tell you what, it's just not happening today. Put that in there. P Potown's probably worth like a thousand dollars, but probably not. So, pack number seven coming up. Throw that in the garbage. No peaks. Peaks. There it is. Throw it on the ground. I get number four. Okay. We have a little eyeball energy. I know it's psychic. I know. I get it. I get it. Lunatone, Lumeria, Cedra, Ale and Grimer, Ladyba, Cutie Fly, Horsey, Venipede, Reverse Foil Crab Brawler, and oh, we got a foil! Yay! Zygarde. Look at he's he's got like a fanciness going on there. So we got ourselves a regular foil. Very nice. And he is a rare, so that's a good thing, a rare foil. And a reverse rare. Or reverse common, I guess, or uncommon. I don't know. I don't know what these numbers are. I don't know what this stuff means. So we got one hollow rare. And we got one of them GX rares. Pretty fancy. And then we're gonna give the last pack. Here we are already, last pack. So hope for the best, but I guess settle for the rest. I don't know, Water Energy, Heatmore, Karelia, Simi Sage. I like all these different uh, elemental monkeys that they have, like the Panseer and the Panpour and all that kind of stuff. It's like I'm psychic. Uh, whatever the top thing is in this set will be the last card. I won't know because I don't know what it is. Majiker. There's a pants here. I got all the monkeys out of this one. Kawhi and Heracross non hollow. Womp, womp, womp. Bad luck. Bad luck. So, what did we get? Let's take a look and see. If I can reach it, I can't reach it. Okay, rule number two. I guess we're going to be putting those closer in the future. <laughs> so, we got. Kawhi, we got Crabrawler, we got Potown, these are all our reverses by the way, Solipede, Noctowl, Merk, Noctowl, Merk, Noctowl, Meowth, and Persian, I like that they both kind of have their matching things on there, that's pretty cool, a Charmander, and then the spicy reverse rare, or the uh, secret rare, I think this is secret, 167 and 147, that probably means secret, right? I don't know. Uh, Secret Rare Energy, a Zygarde, and the Darkrai GX, which is about all we got. So, pretty good. Pretty good little pull. Or terrible, I don't, I don't know. So I think while, uh, while we're here, I'm gonna open up one of these two. I'm gonna open up the Sun and Moon Lost Thunder pack, the blister pack, and see what we can get out of that. So let's go ahead and open that bad boy up. Oh, I can't get it open. Oh, don't damage the things inside because they're so pretty. Well, I just screwed that one up. Oh, well. Don't want to damage the card. There's three. Oh, my executor's already been killed. He's at A. Is this a... Uh, what does that mean? So look at this. It's bent, by the way. But look, he's got a little A on there. I don't know what that means, but it does. it's not a promo card. It's just a thingy. Maybe it means Aeolian. I don't know. I like his little shininess, though. Somebody can tell me, I'm sure. They can tell me what that means. I'm going to put him in here because you never know. He might be worth something someday. And then here's this for peoples. There we go. Throw it in the garbage. And then it looks like I got a little, uh, little collectible coin in here. Look at this bad boy pretty fancy i don't know what it is but uh it's shiny uh now that i'm looking at it it looks like a moltres maybe probably said it on the pack but i guess i don't know put that in there so here we go sun and moon lost thunder we're gonna open up a couple of these i don't know what the best thing in this pack is i do know this pack is impossible to open which is really great thank you so much for that can't get this open there we go throw it on the ground this one for the 
for the peoples. There they go. Throw them on the ground. One, two, three, four. I hope it's four. Otherwise, this is going to be the rare. Nope. Fire, fighting, something, energy. You, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying. Pincer move. Oh, that's a choice helmet right there. That's the choice helmet I've ever seen. Wow. Hey, uh, Morty. Yeah, <clears throat> Morty. It's my Rick and Morty impression, by the way. Don't, don't tell me. I know it's bad, okay? Cub Chew, he needs to really wipe his nose. Poor little fella. Ale and Diglett. Natu. Chikarita. Pachirisu or Pachirisu? I don't know. Don't tell me how to pronounce it. A reverse hollow onyx and a tapu coco. He's definitely heavier. So, oh, he's actually shiny. Look at that. He's got a little foil action going on. I didn't even see that. So I guess that's pretty good. I don't know. He's not full art or anything like that. I don't know what that means. I've seen videos. Somebody says it's good. I don't know. So we got a little, I like this onyx though. This is cool. He looks like um, a burrowing worm, which is very interesting. So, but well, you got a heck of a move there. So that's the first pack down. On to the second pack. Let's see what we got. What we got's going on. It's another hard to open pack, I imagine. Uh, I can't get it open. I'm an old man. There we go. We really gotta dig in here. Oh, don't look at the Yamask. Uh, don't look at the Yamask. Uh, <clears throat> for the people. There you go. Enjoy that. I don't play it. Oh, and by the way, I have like 50 of those things, so we might do like a giveaway or something. I don't know. To get rid of them because I don't want them in my drawers anymore. Uh, energy. Another choice helmet. The choicest helmets. Mantine, Girafang, Yamask, Stunfisk. Yeah, that's pretty much how I feel. <laughs> Titar, Lit the Wick. It's another one of those little crochet boys. Oh, I cheated. Sorry, Chikorita. A reverse Mantine and a non hollow Tangrowth. Stellar. Stellar, 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 stellar. So, and the bad pulls are coming back in full. Please be a Lugia in there in the last pack, because this will be the last one for today. And here we go. Boy, I just decimate these bad packs, don't I? Throw that over there in the pile for the people. Da da da. Shut up. Feeling a little leafy. A Zatu. Why does he look like he has to go to the bathroom? I'm just gonna stand here for a while. Bay leaf. It's a good thing to put on your uh, your food. Uh, Dedeni, I don't know. Snubble, Ralts. He looks like he's staring off lovingly, or he got lost in the woods and needs help. Another Dedeni. Is it like, why are there, oh, there's two different kinds? What is this? You got fairy and you got lightning. Is he like a Pokemon that does a flippy flop, flippy swap? I don't know. Like more Pico or whatever it is. A Cyndaquil, he's got a little gas problem. Pine Co. A oh, I love a good Eevee. Reverse Eevee and an Umbreon non-shiny. But the Umbreon is pretty cool looking. Not gonna lie. So I'm actually gonna put this guy in here because he looks pretty neat. But not really a lot going on in here. I'm the Tapu Coco might be worth something, I don't know. But that's what we pulled. We pulled five. I just put him in there. Technically, we only pulled four, but I thought he was pretty sweet. So we pulled four in there. We'll walk that back over. There's the empties. So we pulled four. We got one hollow and three reverse hollows. So not great, but not terrible. I don't know. Pretty good pile overall. But yeah, so tomorrow we're going to open up uh, something else. I don't know. We'll see. See you then. Bye.